Hello, today we're in Beulah, Wyoming. We're gonna take a tour of the historic Ranch A property. Join us as we take in these beautiful views. The length of the property runs Sand Creek, which is a blue ribbon trout stream. Very, very popular with, with, with fishing. On the grounds, we have the main lodge, which is behind us here, and, this, and it houses about 48 people. It's kind of a bunk bed type thing. It's uh, got a full kitchen facility. Beautiful, beautiful building, log building. And then next to it, we have the Pete Smith cabin, which is a similar building, it's just smaller. But it, it's uh, fully furnished, bedding, everything, and it's kind of a, you know, uh, a really nice place for the little bit smaller groups. It'll accommodate 16 to 18 people. Well, originally Ranch A was owned by a guy in the 20s that was a, uh, I believe he homesteaded this property. He operated it as a fishery, a uh, hunting facility, raised some fruits and stuff here. And then uh, Moses Annenberg purchased the property in the late 20s. He hired an architect out of Deadwood to design all the buildings, the log structures, and then in turn the Juso brothers from the Rochford area built all these facilities during the early 30s. Federal Game and Fish purchased it in the early 60s. And then eventually it was uh, deemed surplus property by the federal government and it was to be put up for auction. There was a lot of local people that had either worked here, attended functions here, they had some kind of ties, strong ties with Ranch A, and they formed the Ranch A Restoration Foundation, and they persuaded the state of Wyoming to get possession of it from the federal government so it would not be developed and destroyed, and they did. And uh, through an act of Congress in Washington, D.C., it was transferred over to the state of Wyoming, and then the state of Wyoming came back to the board and said, you wanted this, take care of it. And so, the board, since then, has operated the facilities. They've opened it up to family reunions, weddings, uh, educational groups, quilters, any kind of an organization, any kind of a group. You don't even need a reason. You can just come out, lease a facility for the weekend or the week. They're nonprofit, and, and they're just trying to restore the buildings and keep them in good shape for future generations. You know, from exit 205 in Beulah, we're only five miles south on the gravel road, so, and there's a lot of people do not know it's here and even like you say if you're local but we're trying to get the word out I guess more and uh, we like to attract everyone in to see uh, what we have here and so that they can experience the solitude and quiet. Some renovation has taken place but uh, the outside you're seeing the buildings that they were so the inside of the lodge is, is just as neat so and doing that and of course we have the Pete Smith cabin too so it's available for conferences or meetings it's just a multiple use facility as it is and not only the lodge but also the cabin available too so you know we'd like young people to come out experience what it is uh, we do have Wi-Fi so but you know experience the outdoors and and uh, hike the trails or just go by the creek or if they're outdoorsy we have horseshoes set up there's volleyball nets set up so there are things to do uh, there's no hunting there's no camping there's no four-wheeling on the property here but you you can fish obviously, so that is available and, and hike and a lot of photography happens here. We do close down the lodge in late October. There is no heat in the lodge particularly. We do close it down for, until late March, early April, depending on the weather So, and how and reservations for what we've got there. But the cabin is basically open year round. So we have a Facebook presence. One of our board members, Ginger Schofstall, she maintains a Facebook presence for us and the Facebook there. And again, we do have our website on ranch.com. You know, if anybody's interested in having a wedding family reunion, any kind of function out here, you're more than welcome to give us a call. Uh, the number is 307-643-3101 and Annette will be glad to take your bookings and get you lined up.